In the late 70s, early 80s, the way people got together was either through the classifieds. They would search through, uh, let's see, what was it? The Recycler? The recycler. Yeah. 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 That's how, that's the ad that we answered, the Recycler. Yes. But, uh, I mean, there, were, there was BAM and there was, uh, I guess, Music Connection, but we, we found each other through Recycler. So. I think I barely turned 16 and, and Alan was still 15. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dark ages. <laughs> A yeah. lifetime ago, or more than one lifetime ago, like three or four. <laughs> It gives you a lot of experience and a lot of perspective. <laughs> and to feel it in the music, I mean, that's what it's all about. And every time you listen to a, your favorite rock and roll or metal song, you're listening to a part of your youth that never dies. And that's what's happening here. It's the youth that never dies. <laughs> So, I mean, coming back to what we're doing as kids, I mean, what better can you ask for to like, get that energy, to get that vitality back? An effing good time! The songs are the same, the songs remain the same. Yeah, the song remains the same. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good that's a good question like why not like six years ago well I mean Alan had the uh, came by and we got together and, and uh, about six years ago and he was always talking about hey let's do Shire let's do Shire let's do Shire and I thought it was a crazy idea I mean I thought it was awesome but you know you got so much other life stuff in the way and, and you, you want to believe that you can do it, but let's face it, life sometimes tells you that you can't do it at that time. So here we are six years later, uh, from 2008 to 2014, now it's 2015, and uh, we're giving it a go. Some new blood and uh, in the band, and it's come see it. That's all I can say. Come see it.